Um, well, yes, there is. Um, in fact, compared to five years ago, there's a bit more tertiary students playing right now from the local JCs and the polytechnics, especially in the universities. They actually grow quite a lot. Um, well, we're hoping to make the sport official right now, especially in schools, because um, other than the polytechnics and universities, it's not that um, like I got an official in the secondary schools and primary schools. So hopefully, when we are able to do that, we actually get more kids to start playing basketball first. Yeah, right now, um, like for example, this tournament, we're trying to get uh, the media to come down, uh, probably take pictures of the event, or probably film the event. Because uh, last year we actually had a live streaming on the event, but this year they weren't able to make it. So hopefully. With uh, more exposure, we get more media coverage as well. Um, right now, the biggest obstacle will probably be not being an official sport. Because uh, with that being an obstacle, um, we are not able to get proper funding. Everything is based on the association funds. Um, when our players go to overseas tournaments, they have to fork out their own. Um, other than that, we always have difficulties booking, booking like facilities for training. So if we were to be an official sport, things would be so much smoother. Um, this win today is definitely a very Hi intense win in terms of that. We have worked very, very, very hard for now. this win today. We went through a year-long season of training three times a week. Um, I could say that really the training pay off, the hard work really pay off. I would say that definitely the team, the opponent, gave us a very, very, very good fight, a very run for our time. And um, I guess it's really up to small little details of being disciplined in the game and everything that we really train for. I guess. It's really up to standard. We really play up to standard. Um, definitely, for the past few years, it's not recognized, but slowly we are being recognized. Sport Council is taking interest in us. Hopefully, Shok could bring the ultimate frisbee in Singapore to a next level, a breakthrough with a win inter internationally and in the Singapore. I hope we, we can do a little, a small part to this community.